Forks Horn and Shank. What's cooking? Cooking enthusiasts would have you believe that a great recipe and presentation just materializes on a clean plate with some colorful syrup drizzled all around the food along with a multi-syllable name to describe it. I, however, am not an enthusiast. I'm much more than that. I like to say that there's a deep-rooted relationship between food and I. From the chopping of the vegetables to the steam in the pot, we're connected. Plain and simple, I love food, but only when it's done just right. I like to believe that cooking is more than a means to an end. I mean, we all want to eat. However, there's a calm that comes over you when you're preparing a dish that you're sure will land nicely in someone's belly. It's almost like therapy. I found therapy in maneuvering to acquire the ingredients while constructing and preparing each of the meals in these pages. You know, luxuries can be a bit difficult to come by in some places, especially in prison. Throughout this unorthodox picture book of amazing foods and dishes that are easy and affordable to make, you'll be gifted with recipes and stories that will make the preparation mean that much more to you. Some are straight from mom's kitchen, sprinkled with love, while others have origins that are rooted in survival, so to speak. Either way, they're all delicious and we'll have you sharing these stories and coming back for seconds. Win Pervecho.